Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for coming to the Lowe Institute on a Friday night. Uh, my name's Stephanie Dunstan. I'm the communications manager here at the Lowe Institute, and it's very exciting to see so many people here on a night where we don't traditionally open up the Lowe Institute, so thank you so much for coming. See the, the future Australia Timor relationship going and whether you see it increasing and broadening or whether you see Timor's future perhaps going more towards Southeast Asia and focusing more on inter perhaps relations with Indonesia and with ASEAN? Yeah, um, in many ways, you know, the direction that that relationship takes depends on, um, you know, some strategic decisions that the Australian government will make. I think in terms of the people-to-people -people relations, um, they, are, they are strong, they are robust, they are built on um, mutual respect and understanding um, as you say, dating back many decades, and in fact, dating back to the Second World War. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> um, so I think at that level, you know, nothing can nothing can touch that that relationship. I guess what my hopes are is, is that finally, um, foreign policy in relation to Timor Leste and you know, aid uh, and development engagement at that level can be brought into line with um, those solid people-to-people -people relations. Um, I think historically, you know, foreign policy on Indonesia and East Timor um, has been, you know, at odds with public sentiment, with, you know, the deep um, solidarity and friendships that exist between the people of the two, country and I, two countries. And I think that's really, really tragic. I would like to see there to be an alignment finally. Now, I wouldn't be surprised if there's not because there never has been. You know, people ask me, are you surprised with the way Australia has conducted itself, you know, for example, over the spying allegations? Are you surprised with how Australia um, is dealing with Timor-Leste over the issue of um, resource sharing? And my answer is no. <laughs> None of it surprises me because I have seen, you know, um, over many decades the the complicity at the level of, you know, our diplomats, um, our, you know, senior politicians in Canberra with Indonesia, you know, I've witnessed all close hand. Um, and uh, it, it saddens me greatly because I engage on a daily basis with just so many hundreds of ordinary Australians who are so passionate about their relationship with Timor-Leste and um, have just such deep friendships with ordinary East Timorese and um, feel really um, deeply interested in, in the future, in building um, you know, a bright and prosperous uh, future for the country. And um, for you, Jenny, um, Ooh, just a very you. small token of I do know that it's East Timorese, I yes, know at least that much. By, um, <laughs> By my foundation. lovely colleagues at the Alola Foundation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.